in a world filled with constant distractions and noise it's easy to lose sight of what truly matters the devil wants to keep us blind and deaf to the messages of god tempting us with fleeting pleasures and shallow pursuits he wants us to be blind not physically but spiritually the devil's ultimate goal is to lead us away from God's love and truth. He wants us to be blind to the spiritual battles that rage around us, to ignore the reality of sin and its consequences, and to reject the saving grace of Jesus Christ. Remember, dear child of God, Spiritual blindness is the most dangerous form of blindness because it leads to eternal separation from God. When we are spiritually blind, we are unable to discern the truth from lies, right from wrong, and the path of righteousness from the path of destruction. We become like ships without a compass. wandering aimlessly in the stormy sea of life but there is hope god has given us the gift of spiritual sight through the holy spirit when we open our hearts and ask god for his help he will remove the veil of spiritual blindness from our eyes and reveal the truth to us we will be able to see the beauty of god's love and the reality of our own sinfulness we will be able to discern the lies of the devil and the truth of god's word we will be able to walk in the light of christ and live a life of purpose and meaning but first you don't have to fall for his schemes You can choose to open your heart and mind to the truth of God's word and let his light shine into every corner of your being. It takes vigilance and discipline to resist the devil's distractions and stay focused on what truly matters. But when you make that choice, When you commit to seeking God's truth above all else, you will find peace and fulfillment that cannot be found anywhere else. Don't let the devil keep you blind to the truth. So let us be vigilant and guard our hearts and minds against distractions and temptations. of the devil let us seek god's truth and wisdom and ask him to give us the gift of spiritual sight only then we can truly see the world as it is and live a life that is pleasing to god now i pray that may god bless you and keep you safe from the enemy always amen